maybe I just have a wide back. I don't know. Hi you guys, so I'm here with my weekly mail, which is 30 things, that's it. But I can kind of stretch it out because one of the things, two of the things are really nice, so. Um, actually, I didn't get any review items this week, nothing. I did get a couple of people's returns, which I'll be going back to the post office again to return that. But um, yeah, nothing, nothing really. But so this is just a regular kind of mail thing and a little chit chat throughout the, the video, whatever. So I got Gray's box here. So um, last month I got all those soups and I haven't tried them yet. Not last month, two weeks ago, three weeks ago. I don't know how, I don't even know how often I get Gray's. If it's every two weeks or every four weeks. Anyway. So if you guys have gotten grays through my codes and stuff like that, let me know and let me know how you've liked them so far. Um, this month we've got pizza. We have the eight box. We have pizza margarita, zesty lime pepper salsa with whole meal pita chips. Oh, I like that. The Brooklyn Bites, which is looks like a lot of nuts and pretzels and seeds and stuff like that. And honey drill, drizzled cashews, which those are good. And then on the second layer, we have the sweet mustard ranch, um, hickory smoked barbecue, wild rice and beans, honey, chili honey, peanuts and almonds. So not a bad box this month. Um, I think I'll try everything in the box. Maybe not the smoked barbecue. I get heartburn, you know, that kind of stuff bothers me. But. So normally the four pack is like $6. And then if you share with a friend or something like that, you can get a dollar off or you can donate the dollar to somewhere that, I don't know, I forget exactly, I'm sorry. I, I forget where it's at, what they donate that dollar to. Something to do with food for others, I wanna say. Uh, don't, don't quote me. Anyway, so normally the free box I think is the four pack. Um, this one is the eight pack. They just kind of upgraded me to an eight pack one day. I didn't ask for it. They just did it and I just accepted. So um, it happens all the time to me. Um, so it's not bad. I mean, they're nice little healthy snacks. I bring them to work and I share with my coworkers. So we enjoy it. And the next thing that I got is was quite surprising. I was not expecting this. I don't remember um, applying to review this or anything. I don't remember but it came in this beautiful little box right here and if you don't know from clarisonic um i was really really surprised it's a beautiful box um and here it just has like um hashtag clarisonic um and this is the new mia fit so they have some paperwork in here you know kind of telling you what it's all about but it's pretty cool because look how nice that they packaged this thing up. So when I opened this, I was super surprised. I was like, oh my gosh, what the heck? Um, so this is a nice little small um, Clarisonic um, facial brush. It's called the Mia Fit. And let me put this box down. So it's nice and compact. I haven't charged it yet. I still have to charge it. You have to charge it for 18 hours before using it, um, but it's cool. It's really nice, small. Um, the brush is, I've never used a facial brush. I actually haven't opened it yet. And it's, you can feel that it's gonna be kind of abrasive for your face, not abrasive. I, I think abrasive is the wrong word. I think like scrubbing, you know, so that it's gonna scrub really well. Um, I don't even know how it works just yet. I'm just excited to get it. So, um, like I said, you do have to charge it for like 18 hours before use and I haven't done that yet. Um, it's just, it sits in a little, um, thing right on your counter and it charges up that way. You don't have to plug it in or anything. It's just, you sit, it sits right there. Um, also included was an additional scrub brush. And I think this one looks to be a little bit more, um, uh, stiffer, I guess you want to say. Um, these are, this is the blue one in here. And then it also came with an Urban Decay Pore Perfecting complexion potion primer, which I'm really excited about because, you know, that's completely awesome. I have never tried one of these. I use, I've used i used their um, eyeshadow primer, but never their face um, primers. So I'm excited to use this, all of it. Um, so this is the little stand that it comes with, and you just sit it right there on top of the stand to charge it. So, so the other thing that I got was from Reta. 
And ThreadUp is a site where you can you can um, send your clothes in, and they do consignment. You don't get a lot of money for your clothes because I did send some clothes in. I actually saw some of the clothes that I sent in on the website. But, um, you know, so it's kind of disappointing that they only give you, like, dollars, if that. Like, like I think less than a dollar per item and stuff like that. Or maybe a dollar and some change per item. So it's kind of disappointing that way. But, I mean, regardless, if you're just going to donate the items, you're not going to get anything to begin with. So, I don't know. It's up to you if you just want to donate it to, like, the Goodwill Salvation Army or to a shelter or to wherever you want to donate your clothing to. Or sometimes what I do, I bring it to work and I give it to, like, the patients and stuff like that. So, um, and we actually do that quite often. So, um, I had some credit that was going to expire, so I wanted to go ahead and use that credit up. So I got one, two, three, four, five, six items. I got all shirts. I was just looking for different tops and stuff like that. All right, so they're just saying, you know, share with your friends, tell your friends all about it. They have really nice packaging. So this is the box that comes in. You open it and it had like little paper and it has like these little tabs that holds the paper in place. Um, and then let's see, how do I open this? Oh, this way. <laughs> okay, so it, and then it opens this way. It says, share the love. Life is full of second chances. And inside, they just have everything all packaged up like this here. So I'm just going to take out this little packet. Um, I'm just going to slide everything out. I'm not going to bother opening it. Um, I used to do a lot with twice. So and twice would have everything in separate little baggies, but this one they just wrap everything in a tissue paper, which is fine, doesn't matter. Um, and what did I get here? I like their little tabs or tags here. It says thread up, renewed with, with love in San Francisco. So I guess they're based out of San Francisco. I like this shirt. I have a shirt almost exactly like this, but shorter sleeves. This is like the three quarter sleeves, I guess. Um, I got. This is a medium, but it's kind of big. It's short in the front, and it has it's longer in the back. I like this. This is like completely my style. I was just looking for new tops. I got this one for twelve ninety nine. It's originally sixty dollars, so um, not bad. This one is from Crown and Ivy. I was just looking for different styles. Um, you can kind of organize um, what you're looking for with the filter. So I was just kind of looking at tops. And I took out tank tops and no sleeves, and I just kind of put blouses and tops and stuff like that. Um, this is another one. It's kind of similar. It's got the three-quarter inch sleeves. Um, it's just like a regular t-shirt with like a, a scoop neck kind of. This one was um, $7.49, and it is originally $24. The next one here is from Gap. This is a kind of brown, brownish burgundy kind of color top. Um, a little longer sleeves, not as long as the other ones. Um, and it's got um, like a, a seam down the back. I got this one because I kind of like this color. I like, I like these kind of dark burgundy kind of colors for myself. This one I got for $7.99 and it was originally $30. This one is from Dress Barn. Um, I thought it was cute. I was like, oh, this is a nice little dressy top. I kind of looked at the picture and I was like, okay. Um, I can see like a little bit of the threads uh, is coming out on one of the little sleeves, which is not that big of a deal. I can just kind of cut it off. This is a size medium. It's nice and thick. It's very well made. Of course, it's from Dress Barn. Um, the bottom, I do see that there's some issues with the clothing here like um, I'll show you a close-up of it but it has where it's kind of I don't know what do you call it the kind of material this is like one of the if one little thread comes out it goes it's almost like stockings it comes from here all the way down so it might not be very noticeable when you have it on really noticeable. but I see it it's kind of it kind of bothers me <laughs> But, you know, I'll definitely try and put it on and see if it's even noticeable. Most of these things were less than $10. This dress barn one was $8.49, and it's originally $30, so. The next one here is from a brand called Chaser, um, and it's cute. It's 
kind of like a very loose fitting kind of top. It has a tiger on it. I thought it was cute. Um, and the sleeves are kind of uh, like folded sleeves, I guess, like sewn in folded sleeves. I don't know how you say it. Um, anyway, so this is originally $48 and I got this one for $13.49. Um, and I used mostly all credit. I did use some cash out of pocket, so, and I'm okay with that. I really like this tiger shirt. I really do. And the last piece I got was from Guess. Um, this one is kind of see-through. This is not what I thought I saw in, in the picture. This is completely see-through. In the picture, it looks like it had an under layer in here. Um, it's still nice, just I guess I have to wear a tank top with it. Um, this one I got for $19.99, but it's originally $71. But I saw on the little paper here that it was free for some reason. I don't know why, but yeah, in the picture, it kind of looked completely different than what it shows here. So really nice. So my total out of pocket was $23.58. And then they ended up giving me back $19.99 for this guest top. Again, I don't know why, um, but that's okay. So I guess I still have another credit left again. So originally everything would have cost if you would have purchased it new, brand new, no problems. Um, would have been $192.56. Um, the total came out to be $76.43, and I had um, credit, and then I paid $23.58 out of pocket. Um, they do charge shipping. Um, when you're looking at the items, they do tell you in the description that there's little, like, wear or tear or things um, things that are wrong with the item. So they do tell you, but they don't kind of they don't show you what's wrong with the item. So. Um, but that's just one of the things that you, you're going to get when you're purchasing um, used clothing. So I'm quite happy with everything that I got, except for that dress bar and top. So if you're interested in checking out ThreadUp, they have everything. They have dresses, they have shorts, tank tops, uh, obviously tops, um, jeans, dress pants, coats, jackets. They have everything in there. Um, so I'm definitely gonna go and check them back out again. I mean, again, I have credit. It says here, if you join with my link, it says share with friends. Your friends get $10 to spend and you get $10 when they spend their $10. So if you wanted to join up, I'll have the link down below. Oh, and if you use mobile, if you download the app, I see it right here. Thread up, it says 20% off your first mobile app order. So if you're gonna do that, definitely take the app, you know, look it up online, whatever, and then you can go on your app and make the purchase on your app. And don't forget to use Ebates, number one. Use the app for 20% off. Um, Ebates, you can use the app on Ebates too, you know, if you have the app there. Um, so, you know, getting clothes at a super discounted price, plus getting some cash back for shopping and more cash back on different websites, you know, be a smart shopper. If you're gonna shop, be smart about it. All right, so I just finished trying everything on for you. And this last top, the guest top, obviously is very sheer, which I knew it was gonna be very sheer. And it looks really pretty on. However, the way that they made this, like you have to stand like this the whole time. Because if you dare to go like this or reach, well, you can't reach forward. But if you were to dare bring your shoulders forward you know if you wanted to slump or something you couldn't slump slump it's not forgiving and it's not like it's loose but they made the shoulders or something i don't know what they did it doesn't fit right you have to be like a super mini mini person with no chest to be able to move in this top it's really pretty it doesn't look like it's tight at all but you can't move in it <laughs> so this is definitely a no-go for me. Maybe I have a nice thin friend and I can give it to them because it's really pretty. You just can't really have like bumps and curves anywhere to wear it. <laughs> All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. I'll see you again in another video. Bye.